Oh, ho, ho, guys. I know it's really late, and Christmas was a few days ago, like two days ago, I think, at this point, and all that, but I still wanted to do a little bit of a little Christmas show and tell kind of thing, you know, show you what I got, and kind of just talk about some stuff, you know, like a little update video while getting to show and tell some of the things that I got for Christmas this year, and basically that's all it is, show and tell update kind of thing. And it's, well, basically start off with, well, I can't even talk because it's kind of, like, I just woke up not too long ago. And I wanted to get this um, made before I went to, like, work later. But I wanted to say that I'm sorry that I'm not uploading as much as I used to. Like, I used to record, or record, have things up, like, every day or every other day or something like that. And that's always been my little schedule. But, like I said, with where I work, I work at Disneyland, so you can imagine how crazy it gets for the holidays, and they have me working like eight hours every day, pretty much, like I get my two days off, but like this week I have random mass days off, I have like Monday off and Friday off, which I don't like because I'd rather have two days off consecutively, you know, like in a row, so that way, you know, I could have like Monday, Tuesday off, or like Tuesday, Wednesday, whatever, but they really went weird this week, and that's going to really suck, but I know why they're doing it, they're doing it so that way, like, they can get me back on track for my normal days off, because I always have Wednesdays and, Wednesdays and Thursdays off, this has been my days off for like two years, and um, I know they're trying to transition back into my normal days off, so they had to give me Monday off. Because they had me working um, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And they can't give me a sixth day. So they had to give me Monday off. They couldn't give me Monday and Tuesday off. Because then I'd be working Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. You know, Tuesday. Just to get back to my days off. You know, so then they gave me Friday. So that way I'd be working Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Get Friday off. Work uh, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and then get my normal Wednesday, Thursday off. Unless they decide to be really nice to me this time and like give me a third day off for like all the days and hours they've been giving me. I don't know what they're gonna do, but they're. I know they're pretty much transitioning me back into my normal two days off. So that's exciting. I'll be happy to have my normal days off again and not have to have random days that I don't get off for a reason. But, you know, it's okay. I will push through it. But, yeah, this week I do have 40 hours, 8 hours, all the days that I do work. I work New Year's Eve, and I work New Year's Day, you know, all that stuff. So, it's going to be crazy, but I, I can't complain too much because they will have me off by 8 on New Year's Eve so I can still go home and I can still do the little you know, dropping the ball count thing, you know, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, you know, that whole thing, and get the count down and do the whole Happy New Year thing, so I can't complain too much, but I can't do too much, because they have me working at 10.45 in the morning the next, you know, New Year's Day, so that kind of sucks, but they're decent shifts, and I will take them, because I could get way, way, way worse shifts than what they're giving me. So I'm not complaining too much, just want to let you know that that's the reason why I haven't been able to upload as much as I usually do and as much as I want to. So after everything dies down a little bit, I'll be able to kind of get back into my rhythm again of, you know, having stuff for you guys every other day or every day again. Like right now, I think I've been uploading every like two days. So I'll be recording probably more of Christmas, the Christmas version tomorrow night, Sunday night, because I think I'm off at 8.30, so I'll get home around like 9, and I'll try to record at least like an episode tomorrow night, and I'm off on Monday, so maybe Monday morning I'll record two more at least, and then I can get one of them edited and try to get that up for you guys on Monday, and then I'll work on Tuesday, Tuesday's going to be a really crappy shift. So it's going to be like a 145 to 1015, which is shitty. But, 
you know, so I won't be able to get anything up that day, but I'll try to get something up New Year's Eve, or at least some little special thing up on New Year's Eve for you guys, and if I do that, then I can get an episode up on New Year's Day, and then, you know, go from there, and like, like I said, after this whole coming week, it should die down a little bit for me, and I should be able to get back on track like I want to. So thank you guys so much for being patient and understanding all that and everything. If I'll still have videos coming your way, don't worry. Like I said, at least every two days, you know, I will have something up for you guys. I've been trying really hard to, to get those up for you and with everything being all crazy right now. And I think that's it for the most part for the updates. I think so. So I'll get to the show and tell part. Uh, one of the things I got was a little makeup bag. It's a Jack makeup bag that my um, my friend got me. It's very cute. And she also gave me like a, a lanyard. That was a Jack lanyard. I don't know how well you can see it. Because I do do... Um, pin trading and stuff like that for Disneyland. Like, it's a fun little hobby here and there. So I could always use it for pins and stuff like that. So that was really cool. I did get the, the Santa hat that I'm wearing for Christmas. I got that for my mom. And it says Saints on it because that's my, my football team that I like. And I know a lot of people probably don't like them. And that's okay. Everybody's allowed to have their own opinion. But I like the Saints. And I got a Santa hat. I also got um, a Saints shirt from my sister. So I like the only merchandise I had of my team is um, a lanyard before. I never had a shirt or anything, and I saw the Santa hat before, and I was really, I really wanted it, but I was there, you know, to shop for other people, not for me. So I left it and got presents for everybody else. But my mom surprised me with that, and that was so cool. Okay, my sister got me that shirt, and then she also got me this really, really cool um, Oogie Boogie uh, beanie. It's pretty awesome. Oop, you're not going to be able to see that that way down. So that was really cool. So I got, like, this beanie and the shirt. I got money from, like, my grandparents and stuff like that. So Christmas money was a gift and I got a couple of gift cards. I got like a gift card to Sinopolis, I think it's called and it's like supposed to be this big fancy movie theater where like the seats recline and people give you you know, like serve you drinks and food and all that stuff while you watch a movie. So I got that. That money. I got movie tickets to go see a movie which I'm planning on taking somebody to eventually. Because I had two movie tickets and I don't want to go by myself. That'd be really sad. And my mom got me like this uh, this blanket. It's just, it's a blue blanket and it comes with like matching blue socks. So I guess you want to match the blanket, I don't know. She got me the blue blanket and it comes in a little like bag and everything. So you can take it easily with you. Um, and I went to my dad's and his wife or whatever, she made me a Saints blanket. So I got like all kinds of Saints stuff this year and I didn't expect that. And it's really cool and it's really, really soft and that was so cool of her to do because she did the whole pattern thing together and the whole, that whole thing. So she did a really good job and it's really cool. I said cool way too many times, but you know, that's, that's how I feel about it. And then I went to my dad's and he got me like the gift cards and everything. And he got me Super Smash Bros. for Wii U. So now I have it. And I'll probably be sitting down and playing it one of these days when I get a chance. So that's awesome. So now I have this for my Wii U. A bunch of candy and stuff like that as well. So Jenny, you don't really need to see the candy. Um, he got me this this Chromecast, I guess, that you plug into your TV or something. And you're allowed to 
watch YouTube or other things on it, or like get stuff from your phone and transfer it to your TV or something like, I don't know, something along those lines. I didn't really understand it too much, but I, I guess so. Except I, I didn't know where this came from, just kind of gave it to me and I'll, I'll take it. I mean, I appreciate anything I get, even though it's random and I don't know if I'm going to use it or not. But this is the really cool one that I was really happy to get that I asked for and it is the blue snowball. So it looks really cool. The packaging's really awesome. So you can kinda see it right there and I got the blue one because I want the blue one and it comes in like blue, green, uh orange, and I think they have like the normal white one or something as well. These are like the new colors, like the neon colors of it. It's really awesome. So I'll probably be trying this out pretty soon. So maybe I'll do a little unboxing thing of this, you know, during this little show and tell update video. I also got like um, a pop filter for it. I don't know how well you can see it. But yeah, I got the little pop filter for it to go over the top and everything. So that was really cool. Uh, let's see if I can get this open. Cause I'm probably really special about getting things open. I can never open letters correctly. That's something that I've never been able to do. It's really sad because my sister and like other people, like they can just easily. Ooh, see, see, I'm ripping things. They can easily get things open while I have issues, and then and things end up ripped and looking really bad. There you go. I didn't destroy it too bad this time. I was able to kind of take a step back and not destroy things. Okay, looks like I got a little manual probably. Letting you know what everything does and how it works. That's good. I will keep that because I'll need to know how I do this. Oh, I think this is the stand. Oh, it's just so nice to like be able to take it out and like actually see it. This is really cool. <laughs> so here it is. Here is the blue snowball. It looks really awesome. I feel like so proud of it. You know, it's just like gaze into my ball. But I can't. I didn't want to say blue ball because that just sounds really bad. You know, because it's not a crystal ball, so I can't really say that. But it's blue ball, so... Okay, we're not going to go there with that joke. See the stand. And there I go, like, pressing buttons. So there's the stand. Assuming. Yep. Okay, there's the... The USB cable that you plug into the back, and we'll plug it into the laptop so that way it works. Get these little. This adorable little stand. I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger. They so got the little stand. Come here, ball. Just putting the ball on here. I have to spin this a lot. Maybe I don't have to anymore and I'm still doing it because I'm special. I don't think so. I think it does have to go more. I don't know. <laughs> there we go. That's it on its stand. And set it off to the side and just record into it. It's so cool looking. I am just like mesmerized by it. Oh. It gets taller. That's okay. I was wondering if it did that because it looked like it's so much taller on the thing. And it does. So you can lift it up and make it a little bit taller so that way, you know, it'd probably reach me better. Just get to talk into it and it's going to be really, really cool. Okay. Let go. Okay. Well, now the ball is going to be attached to this. 
That is really cool. So there you go. That's the blue snowball. And I'll be trying it out pretty soon so that way I don't always have to have a headset on. But yeah, it's really awesome. I'm still holding it kind of just like my precious. And all that weird Lord of the Rings stuff. Okay, I'm going to put this off to the side. And I believe that's all I really have to show and tell. Because like I said, everything else is just like money and gift cards and movie tickets and stuff like that. So, I guess there's my little update video for why things have been a little bit crazy. And kind of when I expect things to not be as crazy. But in the comment section below, I would love to hear what you guys got for Christmas. You know, just make a little list of things you got. I'd love to know and how your Christmas went and what you did. If you can do that and put that in the comment section below, I'd love it so much because I'd love to see what you guys are doing and interact with you guys as much as I can and everything else. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, if you can press that like button, you know, just down there off to the side. Make sure to comment what you got for Christmas and what you did. And I will see you guys in the next Christmas video that I'm hoping to get up to you guys by uh, Monday. Monday morning, hopefully. So until then, I will see you guys later. Bye!